let's learn something new with computer bits daily here we will learn how to find sum of the digits of a number in single line of code before we look at solution we will look at few concepts that will help us to create our solution so let's learn it printf function is used to display output return type of printf is integer and printf returns number of characters printed syntax printf contains format specifier and argument list let's take an example in this example we have taken variable integer num is equal to 21 and this variable num is passed as argument in printf function here you can see in printf we have write in double quotation number is modulo d here modulo d is format specifier and num is argument and output of this program is number is 21 In this program, we will see what printf function will return. Here, variable p of integer type is taken. Whatever will return by this printf function will store in this variable p. Using this printf function, we will print value of p. So, let's run this program. We get the output. This output computer bits is printed by this printer function and this 12 is printed by this printer function. Printer function return number of character printed successfully and that value is stored in variable p. For loop is used to execute a set of statements. It has three parameter: initial value, condition, and re-evolution parameter. For loop can have more than one initial value and re-evolution parameter, but it contains only one condition. The test condition is a relational expression that determines the number of iteration desired or determines when to exit from the loop. The re-evolution parameter decides how to make changes in the loop. Let's create solution for the given problem.
this is the time to test yourself. Question. In C programming, initialization part of for loop executed how many number of times? Option number 1, 1, option number 2, 2, option number 3, 3, option number 4 until condition is true. Take your time and find the right answer. I hope you have find the right answer and the answer is 1. Did you find this helpful? Then please hit the like button, subscribe to our channel and press the notification bell for new awesome videos. Thank you for learning with Computer Bits daily. Keep learning, keep sharing, stay safe.